Well, first of all, we need to find an alternative fleet. We know that climate change is very much upon us and uh, police fleets all over the country are trying to change and adapt to what will be a more modern and sustainable way of getting around and serving the community. This is a brand new motorcycle. It's a Yamaha. It's based on a Yamaha 300 Tri-City motorbike. But this is unique in two ways. One, it's hybrid, so it works off batteries and a 300cc petrol engine. And the unique design through the engineering means that the aerodynamics go right through the bike and not around it. That makes it super efficient and super agile. So we're launching that here today. I've always said here in Northamptonshire, what we need to be is more accessible and more visible. Because of the agility of these bikes, and they can go virtually anywhere, it means that they will be seen in the towns and the cities across the country because we're going to start to use or utilise these in other forces. So Northamptonshire Police will own 12 of them. We will look to lease them out to forces as part of a trial. We will get the feedback and we will adapt and adopt to make sure that they are fit for purpose. The fact that it's a three-wheeler means that it can be ridden on a car licence and that's a really important point in terms of the cost of training. And because it is a hybrid, it's only a 300cc engine but it's got the battery pack as well. It's a very nippy bike so as I say, it's quick, it's nimble, it's efficient, it's effective and it's very, very stable and I quite enjoy riding it. So three years ago, as a National Police Chief's lead for motorcycling, I was contacted by uh, White Concept Motorcycles, which are a company based here in Northamptonshire, who wanted to work with us to make sure that they could help us design a vehicle that was fit for the future. Uh, and this is it. And of course, a clear matter of priority based on neighbourhood crime and dealing with volume crime means that these vehicles will fit in beautifully in terms of the objectives that we have for the force over the next three years.